bastard. <laughs> but my hair looked fucking gorgeous. <laughs> um, a few of my successful friends come to a restaurant recently. Sorry, I'm, I'm on diet, I'm, so I'm sort of slurring my words. A few of my friends, <laughs> a few of my friends come into a restaurant recently, and they're really successful. And then you're creative, and your successful mates come in. One was a lawyer, an entrepreneur, and a doctor. And they're like, oh, how are you, Eddie? How's the comedy? How's the acting? I was like, it's fine. Do you want some pop or something like that? I'm going to make some golf mayonnaise. <laughs> That's all I've got on that one. It's just really depressed me. I'll get onto the suicide a bit later. My ex came in the restaurant. Now, I was in love with him. It's been a few years now. And he sat down in my section. And I knew his mum was ill. And I had to ask him, George, how his mum was. So I said, how's your mum? And he said, she passed away last week. And I was shocked. I liked his mum. And I remember saying to him, I'm sorry. He ran out to see bass. <laughs> <laughs> what was it? Was it a weight? Was it a weight? Because she was overweight, you see. Because I thought it might have been the weight. And I went, was it a weight? And um, yeah, he said, she was four stone in the end. And went, that would have done it. <laughs> So I went and got the specials for him, come back and went, oh, mom. oh my head's chocker. <laughs> it felt really good, actually. I'm not bitter about my ex, I genuinely not. It's in four different parts of the country at the minute. <laughs> Do you know what? He kept getting my name wrong in bed, Sam. He kept calling me, RAPE! <laughs> and no! <laughs> Please stop! He told me because he said I'm lying. He said I'm a liar. I'm trying to keep him. But I haven't come on for two weeks, you know. <laughs> oh, it kicked. <laughs> My favourite film's Fatal Attraction, by the way, I'm just throwing it out there. If you want me gone, you've got to kill me in a fucking bath. Um,